Gourmet chef Ted Allen is here. He's the author of the new cookbook, Pretentious Foodie Bullshit. And he's going to show us how to cook some fussy little foodie dishes for you and all your asshole friends. Welcome Aww. back to the show, Ted. Hey, thanks for having me, guys. Hey. All right. So let's get started now. What sort of stupid, over elaborate, fancy ass meal are you going to make for us today? Well, we're going to cook one of the very most pretentious dishes in my cookbook. Oh. It's a stupid ass, trendy piece of fish coated in some kind of nut you've never heard of, served alongside a puree of baby something or other. Oh, great. Great. That's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Let's yeah. get started. Okay, have at it. First, it's very important to choose the most expensive type of fish you can find for some vague environmental reason that you can then pair it back to your faux intellectual gay wad oh. dinner party guests. Okay. And now I assume all these other ingredients are organic and locally sourced and all that bullshit? Oh, yeah. Your dickhead friends think that's really important. Mm. So here we have some freshly ground cob nuts. Cob nuts? Ooh, just the sound of that name makes me furious. It is annoying. Yeah. Well, I've processed the nuts using this vintage mortar and... Actually, you know, I think I'll spare you the details. Suffice it to say, it took way longer than necessary. Mm -hmm. So you just gently dredge your fish in your crushed cob nuts. Oh, see, I'm getting furious all over again. And then you just cook your fish for three minutes aside. Now, uh, what about the uh, pureed baby turnips, Ted? Ah, <laughs> you must blanch them for 30 seconds, then you shock them in an ice bath, peel them, then boil them again with a little sugar, thyme, and a pinch of salt. Then put on a blindfold and see if you can taste the difference between these and boiled turnips straight out of the can. Oh. You won't be able to. So you mean all of this is just an enormous waste of time? Yes, it is. It really is. I mean, to hell with this shit. Let's just get some real food. 